Hey guys, it's Brenda from my Wee Wee Bones Cradle, and here I have Ellen with me. Oh, she's so sweet. She's so sweet. I love her. She is a partial silicone. She's by Angela Lewis. I own two Angela Lewis goats. Um, this one is called the Little Warrior. <sighs> and she is a preemie size. And she is wearing an outfit that she came in. And this hat that's on her head was created by the artist. Or she, not by the artist, the, the owner previous me. Um, Ellen here is second hand. I found her off of a Facebook selling group of Reborns and silicone dolls and she is from Canada. The owner, the previous owner is from Canada so of course I'm going to try and get her because if I buy dolls from the US or elsewhere it's going to be really really expensive in fact. Mm, she's so sweet. Can you see her? She is also bald. Um, I wanted to buy a Paradise Galleries doll. Two of them, actually. There was one on sale, the Millie or something by I forget. But she was on sale. There's a sale going on right now, you guys. And um I wanted to get her and I wanted to get the uh, Ming Su, the one that looks like Eric, and using a discount code. And so it would have ended up costing me like both dolls together for um, like $140 US, which is really good for two dolls. But then added on the shipping to get here and the custom fees, it was well over 200 USD and I can't afford that right now. So <sighs> I can't even afford Paradise Gallery dolls, even unless there were free shipping. But anyways, I am going to change her and it's not sunny at all. It's really cloudy. But I think the temperature is kind of warm. So I will put her down. I'm going to get carefully, carefully, carefully. And this color is all going wonky. So um, I'll put you on a tripod. Just a minute, guys. Uh, so here she is. Her name is Ellen Ripley. And she is named after the movie Aliens from Ellen. <laughs> but I would like to take her out of this outfit as much as I love it on her. She looks so comfy in it. But um, I also want to show you her details. But she is a partial silicone and her mouth does open. Oh, it's so cute. Oh my goodness. She's bald. Aww. She is so sweet. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Her sculpt name is Little Warrior. Warrior. Little Warrior. How come I want to say Warrior? I mean Warrior. <laughs> and um, she is meant to be a premature baby. Oh my goodness. And I love how realistic she is. She was created by Angela Lewis. She does have a twin, but I'm not sure what the twin's name is. Oh, the zipper is bothering me. Okay, I'm trying to... I know that you're on camera, and the camera is facing... Let's see. But um, I did purchase her as a boo-boo baby. That means there's a flaw about her. I love her little legs. Oh my goodness. <laughs> ah. 
I'm gonna cr I don't wanna cry. She's so realistic. She sculpted so well. She is so realistic. Like silicone is amazing. I almost thought about selling her and then I thought, what am I thinking? No way. I wanna take off my rings. Because I'd hate the thought if I accidentally scratched her. Just button tough there. She's wearing um a preemie sized onesie that I found from Walmart. It's a Carter brand. And it fits her really well. I'm trying to be gentle. Because this arm is where she has a flaw. Well, I want to be gentle with her anyway. But also, but no, I think it's because she's so creamy sized that I just want to be gentle with her. Oh my goodness, her markings are perfect. I'll show you her details. Okay. Okay, so. This is her face. I see that she's missing some brooding right here, which is, um, I think she came like that. So once I learn how to root, I'll, I'd love to try and give her new eyelashes. As for her painting, it's still really perfect. Um, her mouth opens for a full pacifier while a little pacifier or a bottle. She is bald, but I mean her details are wonderful. Here's a little ear. I'm not sure if you can buy this scope anymore. I really don't know. I can't afford brand new silicone, so I'm never looking at their sites. So, this is one. I see that there's a bit of paint missing near the tips, but that's normal. I did buy her used, but I think it's still pretty awesome. I love these red markings. This is her elbow. Now, what I love about Angela, see, these are the flaws that maybe some people, like, see how it got poured and it's really shiny there. But I personally love owning silicone. This is where her flaw is. There's a little tear in her arm, in her elbow. You don't really want to, but it's in her crease. So, oh, she's so sweet. She has a cloth body. These are her legs, which are so cute, so delicate. It's her feet. Sorry, my camera is going in and out of zoom. This is the bottom of her delicate little feet. And then. Another side is pretty much the same. She does have like these frog legs going on, which are cute, especially for a preemie. And she could curl up because she's silicone. So, anyways, I'm gonna put her back onto cloth, onto a blanket so she can be more comfortable. She has a few creamy things that I have for her. So, lift this up. She still smells amazing, by the way. Okay. Put my rings in this thing. So, okay. Here is a bin. I will just. Move her for a minute. Oh, I love you. Oh. Show you this. 
because I forget what's in here. Oh yeah, she came with this cute little creamy sized kitten sleeper. It's gray with light pink polka dots everywhere and the feet on it are little kittens. Fits her well. Oh, here's a headband that I made for her. I have a tutorial on this. <clears throat> I bought her. This is a set from um, Walmart. It's a shirt. It's not a onesie, but maybe I'll put her in this. It's a yellow shirt, premium size, with two sheep in the center. There's a, a bigger sheep with a beautiful pink bow on her ear. And then a little baby sheep right beside her. And then... They are creamy gray pants with the same color of yellow polka dots everywhere. And on her little butt is a picture of a sheep. <laughs> so cute. I'll put her in this outfit. And I have a few boy outfits in here too because I also have creamy boys. This is what Jennifer gave me. It's a onesie. She, um, the purpose leave was for Amberly, my tink sculpt. This is one of my, um, this is a white, old-fashioned cloth, but it's a, from a real baby. I think my real sons wore this. It fits preemie. Here is that preemie blue sleeper. Oh, this one's cute. This is a preemie boy. It's a sleeper but it's uh snapped all the way down the front center and then extends down to the legs but it's light blue and there's a gray dogs everywhere and it also has like this like um the mitted sleeves but this one is really really small it's even smaller than the than the well the spy carter preemie but I don't know, maybe it was washed a few times because it's really extremely small. And I do have a baby that fits it. Boy, this is a burp cloth that I found from a secondhand store. I had two of them, but I gave one away with a box opening when I sold one of the dolls. Um, here's some socks. Let's see what color can go with those. Not really. These are boy socks. Ooh, these are cute. They're green, though. They're not really match the yellow, but... I don't have... Oh, here's another preemie shirt. Oh, it's a unicorn. It's the one that goes with her. With her onesie that she's wearing. By Carter's preemie size. I wonder what the pants are in here. This is um, um, a very small cloth diaper. I just put it in here because I was going to um, do a box opening with it, but no one bought the doll that I was trying to sell. So, and it has a real cloth in there. You could take it out though. This part, you could take it out. But. It goes in here. Like that. Oh, these aren't cloth. These are like those plastic. Really older fashioned kind. It says it's green. Let's see. Gentle and genuine green. Giddy. All these G words. Let's see. I'll put it back together. Let's see what brand it says. It's by G Diapers Newborn. Six to ten pounds. I was trying to sell one of my Tina Kiwi sculpts. My, um, see, it's really old fashioned. Um, but she didn't sell. I forget what. I think it's the David by Tina. No, not the David. The, I forget her name. It's one of her pre smaller newborns. 
by Tina Keeley. She's bald. <clears> hey, <throat> okay, this one is a premium sized diaper shirt cover. Like undershirt, diaper shirt. It's yellow and it has a cow on the patch, on the side patch. It's by George, by, oops, by Creamy. And this is, oh, here's the, here's another onesie, I believe. Yes, it's a onesie. It'll go with that yellow one. It says, cutest baby ever. <clears throat> and this is another Creamy, light green, plain. Could be a girl or a boy. Creamy. This is a headband that came with um, my Coco Malu that Wendy reborn for me. I named her Arinda. Oh, here's some scratch mittens. They're for boys. But still, I like the white, so normally when I put them on a girl, I put them on the inside like that. So maybe I'll borrow these. They all have a hat to go for her, though. I don't know where the pants are to these. They're in another bin. So, put these back. I'll put the, oh, do I have socks for her? I have these scratch mittens. And I'll put, I'll put on that hairband even though it doesn't really match. Yellow, but. I have these socks too. I don't know. They kind of aren't too pink. Let's see. Where's the other socks? Or did I take them out? They're on this side. Oh, they fell. They fell at my... Okay. So I'll put this back. I'll put the other one back after. I also, I didn't show you guys this, but I do have a blue bin for my growing pacifier collection. <laughs> it's quite big. Let's see if I can move you up. A bit, move you back a bit. This bag says for fit silicones and small, so maybe I'll keep that out to find a passy for her. I don't keep passies in the silicone mouths, so I don't want them stretched over time. These are mixed. They're either honey bugs or tipped or... I don't know, it's weird though. I used to think that all... Certain magnets, like, you know how they flip-flop? Like, either some dolls take one side, some dolls take the other side. But I have some polarities that work for both. This is kind of weird. But one of these days, I want to go through all these classifiers and um, try and give, like, that the babies um, use them. Like, not share them anymore. Like, have, like, this is so-and-so. This is so-and-so. <clears throat> These are certain polarity. These are all the twin sets that I ha I picked out for my twin A's. I have twin twin A's, and these are all the girl boy pacifiers that they can share. These are all clips. Oh, actually, maybe I should get a clip for her. I never use clips, and then these are just all. Bigger sizes are random, but I used to be addicted, <laughs> and I bought a whole bunch of these. When they gave me, I love those. I love, um, I love Superman too, <clears throat> but I I used to collect them. I don't anymore, even the old fashioned. This is from the dollar store. This is so pretty. Okay, but these are the bigger nipples. Oops, these are these are bigger. Too big for the silicones. So, I, oh, 
put this away and pick out a cup for her. These ones I need to put magnets on. Look, it's boots. Boots. This one just fell. Okay, so I'll pick one of these for her to go with her unicorn outfit. Let's see. This is her outfit, and she will be wearing this on top. And I want a clip for her too. So, move it back in closer. And sorry, the lighting is not that great. But it has to be small too for her. Actually, this could match the. It kind of has the same pink in the sheep, and it matches the headband. So, they kind of match. Oh, sorry, my throat, my voice is. I'm getting into a coughing fit again. This is too much. Oh, too much red. I might have to. This is cute. But there's no real purple. This one matches more than that one. Big bird. I don't know if that's too much yellow. Cute little monkey. Alright, no, it doesn't really go. Shim, that might be too big for her. I don't know, so far this one. And this is cute. But there's no blue at all. And the sun is starting to shine. Hmm. So those are the three so far that I might want to try on her. This might be too big for her mouth, but I don't know. So far, I like I love that one the most. Oh, here's a bee, but there's no blue anywhere. Sorry, to show you what I'm going through here. I'm trying to and most of my smaller ones are for boys. <laughs> I do have a couple of boy pennies. This one's cute, even though it's car, but it matches her socks. It'll match her socks. Uh, foggy. Isn't that cute? Sailboat. Monkey. Big cow. But it's kind of big. Even though it's so small. Mm. This is cute. And I kind of like this bee one, but... There's some gluten. Oh, no, I think that's about it. Yeah. Hmm. Oh no. Not this one. Maybe not the big bird. I think it's either these. Three, not this one. It's an Elmo with yellow. It's too harsh, too red. I mean, I know I have red in the flower, but I don't know if two of those I Hmm. Well, I'll try those. These ones. These clips, I'll pick out my clip. Let's put her in this really cute outfit that I have for her. Oh, she is so sweet. 
I know it's my voice always goes weird like that. Oh, and she wears creamy diapers. These are by Huggies. I thought I found this little hat. I'm not sure if it'll fit her, but it matches her socks a bit. <laughs> but it might match make this look more matchy matchy. So I'll try on this hat, and I chose this one because um, I noticed that this nipple will fit her little mouth better. See how it's like just round. Um, these ones, I looked at them closer, and they're bulbous at the end, and I don't, <clears throat> I don't want to cut them. So I'll use this one because it's just straight through. And it matches her socks. Let's see. And then I thought with the hat, it would look more unison. But here's some baby powder. <clears throat> it's not the cornstarch kind because I don't have any right now but I like using this so that the pacifiers go in better it works like butter and it smells really good besides the excess I just rub on her <laughs> On your clothes. Mmm. You smell lovely. Let's see a bit. Um, make sure I don't rip her or nothing. Aww. <laughs> Looks a little big on her. Especially from your angle. <clears throat> Looks sorry. <laughs> Looks a little big on her, but let's see with this hat. Oh, she looks somewhat like a boy. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, she is sweet. It's okay. Oh, so find a clip that will match. <clears throat> Maybe one that'll match the pink. Not that much. This is. Ooh, this might match. It looks a little, a little long. I think someone, someone gave this to me. It's too blue. Too boyish and dark. Nope. Boyish. Definitely boyish. I hope you can watch me when I'm doing boyish. No. 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 Maybe. No, it's kind of too purple. Super brown. Oh, this pink, pink sheep. I don't know. I think it's a rabbit. Hmm. Or this one. No, I kind of like this one. So. Do I. 
I don't even know how to use this. Do I put it in like this? Or at the bottom? The, the hole is too small. Because I don't. It doesn't go around like this. Although I think it would. This is how my sons have them. A shame, my. I was lucky my sons didn't need a pacifier much. Jeremy used it for six weeks. Brendan used it the longest. He was about six months when he finally quit. And then, yeah, I like it better. Like, ooh. No. <laughs> Put this back once. And then, um, Eric was about two weeks. He didn't even want it. Now. Why is it always backwards on me? Oh, I know what I'm doing. There. Shut up. Oops. Oh, I know, buddy. <clears throat> there. Oh, wait. Let's, let's go see if I can hit the slide. There. Aww. <laughs> she seems cold though. Mine looks short. Aww, she can look like a boy. <laughs> That's okay. I don't care. Because you look cute. Ellen Ripley isn't exactly a full blown female herself. Well, she is, but I'm saying her character. She's she's just as good as any guy. If you know the movie, you know who Ellen Ripley is. Hey, Ellen Ripley. Are you like that because your mom is like me? <laughs> Gender neutral. Aww. Aww, she's cute. Anyways, I'm going to leave her like this for the day so I can look over at her. She's sweet. After a while, I'll probably take this off, take these off, and put her in, like, if I could find a sweater for her, that would be great. Here's Ellen. She's beautiful. Um, hope that you guys are having a great day. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, bye guys. Bye. Love you. Have a great day and many, many hugs and blessings to all of you. I know I didn't say that. <laughs> People are like, what? What is she saying? <laughs> but I do mean it though, guys. Take care.